So the reason I don't eat vegetables is because, you know, um, I strive to follow nature's laws or God's laws in regards to, you know, well, everything in life, but specifically how I eat. And so when I observe nature, nature shows me that every species in nature eats what it eats in its natural state. And so when I think about uh, vegetables, one, vegetables aren't appealing to me. You know, if I go into, say, like a, a farmer's market, a grocery store, you know, and I'm in a produce section, you know, when I'm looking at the fruits, you know, if they're organic, you know, I'm picking them. I'm eating them while I'm in the store, you know, grapes. I see a bag of organic grapes. I'm eating some, you know, strawberries, blueberries. You know, I just, you know, <laughs> they just entice me. They're, they're just so attractive and appealing you know when i see vegetables there's no desire in me to taste anything you know vegetables look nasty to me all of them you know um there's just nothing in me that wants vegetables also i can't eat vegetables in their natural state you know, when I used to eat vegetables, you know, it would be in a salad with some type of dressing and just a bunch of other shit mixed into it. That don't really count, you know, as eating vegetables, you know, um, which brings me to another law of nature that shows us that every species in nature eats one thing at a time. You know, and we're we're not exceptions to this and we try to be exceptions to this and we try to rewrite nature's laws or God's laws and we end up in the hospital 100 percent of the time. You know, you can't rewrite these laws, you know, so this is what I strive to live by and to, you know, live in alignment with nature's laws. You know, I don't really give a fuck about what man say about how to eat. I'm looking at what nature is saying because nature is telling me how to eat. And so I follow that. And you know, I've never seen anybody just, you know, eating raw spinach, eating leaf after leaf after leaf or raw broccoli or raw kale or raw potato. I just never seen it, you know, because you can't do it. <laughs> I even raw like the closest I've come is raw carrots, you know, and they're they're edible. You know, if they're cleaned really well, like I never ate the actual raw carrots. It was always like the baby carrots, you know, that were thoroughly cleansed. Who knows what else was done to them? But even that, even those were hard for me to eat, like with nothing. I needed some type of dip to go with that, you know. And so the bottom line here is if it's nasty, we're not supposed to eat it. We're not supposed to make nasty shit taste delicious so we can eat it. We're supposed to stay away from nasty shit. And it's such a simple principle to follow or such a simple guide to follow. If it's nasty, you ain't supposed to be eating it. If it's good, you're supposed to eat it. Like it couldn't get any more basic or simple than that. And so that's why fruits, they just taste good in their natural state. You don't have to make them taste delicious. Nature gives them to you and they're already delicious. And so that's why no vegetables for me. Um, I also don't drink water. Pretty much everything we've been told is bullshit. And so that's it. I hope that answers your question. Uh, I feel like I did. Um, and I hope, you know, I hope that makes sense to you. Um, if you'd like to see me do a video on a particular topic, then uh, leave it in the comments. If it's something I feel like I'm qualified to talk about, then I'll make a video.